Hey, what's up, Dean? For your performance, and we're at the shop today. Uh, crazy day. Um, we got a bunch of stuff going on, but we got the 63 up on the lift. Um, motor sitting right there. Uh, I got the other motor on the stand out of here. I have to get that motor onto that stand, get it out front, get it cleaned up. Uh, we're working on this project which is a moon actually um and then probably lost the keys now they're in the door we uh had a little visitor today brought up a battery for us and you can see over here the gold car is gone Jeffrey's truck is as close to the bathroom as I can get it right now. Still got the Monte Carlo SS with the LS swap. Still waiting on the Terminator X. But Zach brought us up a battery today. And we got his Mustang uh, up and running. Um, I got it up to temp with him here. And then, uh, you know, those kind of oopsie forgot types of things that happen um i forgot to tighten the turbo feed so it had a little bit of a oil spill um and i'm not sure what i did but the 12 volt key on wire to the terminator i wired it into the factory harness and it's not keeping 12 volts when you go to the crank position so I may need to dig over there, find the wire, and bring it back in, but I just need the light to trigger the starter. We got it up and running uh forgot my laptop so that sucks um I'm plug the battery charger in because we don't have an alternator or nothing like that uh, i also put it in gear it does bump into gear so that's a good thing jeff's truck we got the new radiator and uh three inch intercooler tubing we got the Intercooler on order for it. That'll be here. Where the oh, <laughs> um, so we are trying to get cars out as quick as possible. Just trying to do a little update video because I haven't put one in a little bit because we've been working on a bunch of projects that were, like I said in one of the other videos, we're not really allowed to film or i should say post those videos because they're for the theme parks so um the guy that we do those projects for uh he prefers that we don't um put them up on youtube which is fine um so i also messed with my truck let's see if this piece of crap will start um I was having issues the other day. It wasn't starting for some reason. And then today, I decided to figure it out. So, let's see what she do.
truck was cold, fired right up. Um, previous issue I had was the wideband. That's the Holly wideband. This is an AM because I run an AM on this side. Um, this was the Holly wideband. And I had an issue. I had, I had started the truck a couple of times, didn't really pay attention, but the air fuel was bouncing all over the place. It was going crazy. And it was the wideband had gone bad. The O2 sensor had gone out in it. So I brought another one over um, from a different kit, but it's too short. Um, the Holly one is extremely long, so this one doesn't even go into firewall. So I said, well, I mean, I have that one in that bank. I'll throw it in that side, plug it in, see what happens. And sure enough, everything's back. It took a while for it to kind of figure itself back out but um, made it work. Uh, I do have to change one of the push rods that um, we stole for Chris's car. Uh, I don't know how I always do it, but I seem to lose push rods. Um, so we are gonna start working on this again uh, very soon. I miss it and I miss driving it. So definitely need to get back on it and uh get out there and start making hits with it but i just wanted to make a quick like kind of update video it was crazy today pushing cars and moving everything around to get everything situated um and like i said we had zach run up and he um brought the battery which is much appreciated uh that he did that for us so we got his car running he's super stoked um like i said I'll, I'll put that in in a little while ago earlier in the video whatever but yeah just a quick update that's what we got going on i'm headed out for today but do me a favor hit the thumbs up subscribe to the channel leave me a comment appreciate you watching have a good day